Hey yo guys, Shepard Speed back with another video. So in this episode, we're just going to be highlighting Noctowl. Hopefully we can get some good victories with him. He's failed me a few times in the past, but let's just see what we can do. Uh, before we get into the match, guys, like, comment, and subscribe if you want daily Pokemon Duel coverage. And let's see what we got here. Let's see who we're coming up against. Who the main man's going to be. You know what? We're so trash we got an AI. Okay, not going to lie. The last battle I played, I recorded... And it was pretty tragic. I got like a double miss with Noctowl. I'm probably not going to upload the video because it was pretty terrible. But that's why we got an AI. So we're going to take the swift victory with Shuppet. We're going to take the swift victory. And then we are going to... Um, we're going to get into a real match. And hopefully showcase really what... what uh, Let's just put him right here. There's no way they're going to go on the goal. They're never that smart. Next defend, and he's going to do something stupid. Yeah, I knew he was going to do something stupid. So, AI, trash, as per usual. But we were trash, so we deserve the win. We deserve the quick win. Now, I've decided that no matter how this episode goes, I'm going to upload it. Because I've been trying to get some good, good, good uh, video of Noctowl, and he's really, really failing me. So, I'm going to try one more time, win or lose... You know, he's going, he, it's, this video's going up. I'm doing it. We're going straight in. So, into the real battle right now. Let's see who we got. Now, I did test around the sleep deck. I put, like, um, Ivasaur and Jigglypuff and Wigglytuff in my deck. And it really did not go well. So, we're going to try again. Man, the Pisquex got a double Moltres, Articuno, Shuppet, Zekrom, Rhydon. Bruh, come on, man. I just got a little... I just got a little owl. Just got a little owl and a ghosty against you, man. He's got a ghost, too, though, so... He's got he's got the main man, Shuppet, too. Let's see what he does here. Probably start out with the Shuppet. I mean, that's what I would do. Whoa. Very, very interesting decision. Starting out with the Moltres. So we are going to start out with Shuppet. Because that's... He's our man. Yeah, he's our man. Shuppet is our man. He is king. Shuppet is king around these parts. So, I don't know what he's doing. I'm assuming he's going to go on the goal right now. He's a higher rating than me, so you would, I don't know. He went on the goal. So, this is actually a pretty decent opportunity, hopefully, to test Noctowl. Because I don't, this man's not playing aggressive. Pisqueak, Pisqueak, you're not playing aggressive. And I honestly, I do not mind in the slightest. So, we're going to set up our defense here with Vibrava. And then I'm thinking I'm going to send Leafeon up. Now this Articuno's got a st that, that cold that straight cold crush to a 90. That's not a good scenario for me. Uh, we're de we're definitely gonna put I was gonna put up Leafeon. Yeah, I'm gonna put up Leafeon. I'm putting him here just so I can I don't know be more in a, a oh gosh he's just I'm just surprised by his moves right now. I'm gonna put Flygon to back up Leafeon. That Shuppet still hasn't come out? You know, I'm really intrigued by this man. Pisquick, you got a plan. I need to learn. I don't know what you're doing, but... Now, 91 and 70. We're definitely going to have to challenge that with Lugia. The problem is, is that he knocks us out most of the time. So I'm thinking that I might X-Attack. Alright, guys. This is a calculated risk. Alright, this is a calculated risk. I'm going to X-Attack on Lugia. Because this Zekrom is a problem, and if he attacks me, I'm probably going to lose. So we're going to X-Attack, and he got a fly. Very bad situation. He can definitely now surround my Lugia, which is a problem. Whoa, bro, you could have surrounded my Lugia. That was a mistake. Oh, unless he hurdle jumps. Ooh, if he hurdle jumps, I'm actually in a pickle. Don't hurdle jump. Don't. Oh, he hurdle jumped. Man. That means we are going to have to hurdle jump. Yay. Yay for hurdle jumps. We're going to have to hurdle jump with Vibrava. Put him right there. The good thing now is that his Zekrom, if he was smart, he'd put him back on the entry point. Because, I mean, you know, maybe maybe that's not the best decision. That's what I would do. I'd put him back on the entry point because he's going to get surrounded if he doesn't. Oh my gosh, he's going for the attack. Vibrava. Oh, look at that supersonic. By Brava coming in clutch. All right, now Noctowl's gonna come in clutch with the quick surround. Gonna get that quick surround on the Zekrom. All right, so far so good, guys. So far so good. 
So the Articuno is going to come up. Yep, obvious, obvious play there. Um, I think at this point I'm going to... Should I do it? Yeah, I'm going to do it. I'm, I'm not, well, no, I'm going to, I'm going to double chance. I'm going to double chance with the Articuno. Or with the Flygon against the Articuno. That's my plan here. I have a pretty good shot to hit purple. Of course he hits his Ice Charge. We're going to respin. Maybe we could get Flyway. And then we got Draco Meteor. Man, that was a waste. I will admit that was a waste. But, you know, to be honest, what, I mean, I had to, this Articuno is going to be doing issues. You know, he's got a lot of strong birds right now. Now, I need to be worrisome because my Lugia is in a situation where he can get surrounded. And he's going to attack. Now, hopefully I can just knock him out. I did get a dodge against a horn drill, so that's pretty good. But if I don't knock out this Rhydon, I'm in trouble. So it doesn't help if I X attack. I already wasted my double chance, so we're just going to go for an attack. And I got the Hurricane, so that's good. Okay, that's good because now my Lugia can't get surrounded right now. Um, I think I think we're going to pull up with Lugia. I'm looking at everyone's options here, and I don't see... I don't see one that's like really okay. I'm surprised that he's doing that to be honest. So this Draco Meteor is great because if I knock out this Moltres, I win. So if I knock out the Moltres, and of course I don't. Just that's just typical. So I'm gonna cover the entry point here, and we're gonna see how it goes. I still have six pokes, and he has five, but he only has what three on the board. He's going to go for the knockout on Shuppet. Shuppet, Shuppet coming in strong. Shuppet coming in strong. Okay, so let's take a look at Moltres right now. Okay, he's got a pretty good chance to miss. Should we X attack? Um, I'm just going to go. I'm just going to go for the surround, guys. I'm just going to go for the surround. We're going to end our turn. I know he can attack Shuppet again, which would be unfortunate. But... If, if, I, if he's going to have a miss percentage, he's going to attack Lugia. Very interesting decision. And I got a miss. So that's just that's just typical. I got a miss. Okay. At this point in time, let's just... I don't want to attack Moltres. I just want to see his wheel. No, what is... What the... Did you guys just hear me? I said I don't want to attack Moltres. I just want to see his wheel. Just because I want to see his damage. But now, of course, thank God I got lucky and I got Roost. Okay, so... He's going to put Shuppet out. He can surround my Leafeon, which would be terrible. Okay, now yet again, I don't want to see... I just want to see Moltres' wheel. 110, 60. Pretty good shot if I X attack I get the, against the Steel Wing or a miss. I'm going to go for it. I'm not... I'm not I just want to... I want to take some risks right now. Probably not the right decision, because Leafeon can get surrounded. But, you know, we're going to do it. Ah... Ah, that swift crushing flames. Alright, we are officially in a bad situation. Officially in a bad situation. Okay, so here's my new goal. I need him to attack Flygon. I need him to attack Flygon. Because if I can hit Draco Meteor, and I can knock out the Moltres, then I will win with Shuppet. So, I think we're going to send Noctowl up this way. And see if maybe I can get some some clutch with Noctel. Now I know what that did. I know that opened me up. I know that opened me up. I did that on purpose. Ice charge because my Flygon's sitting right there. So I want him to attack Flygon. So let's see what he does here. He's gonna challenge me with a ride on. Which is pretty normal. Pretty normal stuff there. And we're just gonna lose. We're just gonna straight lose. Clutch was not clutch enough. Alright, so, oh my gosh, he's evolving too, into Rhyperior. Okay, we are in a very, very bad situation. So, we're just going to have to attack this Moltres and hope for the best. Draco Meteor, Draco Meteor. Okay, we got to fly away, which isn't terrible, but it actually is, because now he can go in from the left, and then I'll have to, well actually no, he'd have to go in from the right with Moltres. He's coming in with Shuppet. Okay, I have a pretty good shot to beat Shuppet. So we're going to go against Shuppet. Because if I get Draco Meteor, that's the goal here. Ah, oh, man, he got Wisp. 
Okay, that's not good. That's not good. So now, he can get... He can come in with Shuppet. Now I have to knock out Shuppet. Okay. The knockout Shuppet. That shouldn't be that difficult. Oh my gosh, we did it. Okay. So. Right now. We're in a very bad situation, but hopefully we can salvage it. We need to hit with Draco Meteor. Who has a better... They're both the same, but you're weaker. I'm just going to attack the, the Articuno. Hit Draco. Hit Draco. Ah, oh, the flyaway. Not the worst case scenario. We fly away right next to him. At least that means if Vibrava dies, we can replace him. He's just gonna... He's coming in. He's coming in strong. We're gonna attack again. We just need to get some luck, guys. That's all we need. Some luck. We gotta fly away. That's also not that great. I'm gonna have to put him here because I don't want to send Flygon on the flank and have him stuck forever. So now... Okay, he attacked me. If I can hit Draco Meteor... Okay, it, I did it. Okay. Guys, this is it. If I can hit Cold Herb with Crushing Flames... Oh my gosh, so unlucky. So unlucky. We're going to put Flygon right here. So unlucky. Man. Attack me again, please. He's going to attack me again. I need it again. I need it one more time. Okay, guys. It happened again. Moltres, please. Crushing Flames. There it is. We've won. Guys, we have won. That was a really hard match. Like, in terms of... I felt like I was, his pokes just outclassed mine. So, I mean, he did have three birds, a Zekrom and a Rhyperior, just saying. But, we won, guys. So, I know in the comments you're going to be like, Hey, Shuppet, you should have done this and you should have done that. Yeah, I probably should have, but I didn't. So, you know, <laughs> you live and you learn. I'll watch the tape back. Uh, do let me know of misplays, guys. I want to hear misplays, I, but I don't want to hear, you know, like you should, you like the you're stupid, you should have done that, you know. So just let me know what I should have done in terms of, you know, making a better play. But at the end of the day, we won, so I'm not too bothered. Uh, from this, we're gonna get a ooh a hoot hoot. We could evolve the hoot hoot into the Noctowl. Maybe that'll be in a future episode. But if you guys liked it, like, comment, and subscribe for daily Pokemon Duel coverage. And Shepard Speed signing out.